Hello guys, welcome to Let's Talk. I'm still not using the green screen yet <laughs> because I don't have the capabilities to do so, but it will be coming soon. Um, so at the minute you can just admire the, the beautiful sheet behind us. Um, it does make it look a bit more new, like a new studio though, doesn't it? It's nice, yeah. the lights and stuff. Yeah, we, we're getting this lovely. Yes. Right, okay, so today, guys, no, just keep it there, keep it there, it's professional, it's a fucking new studio, Jesus Christ, <laughs> hands off my equipment, please. Uh, <laughs> welcome to Let's Talk. Um, today, we are going to talk about blasphemy. Blasphemy is basically um, poking fun or, or, or being... Uh, verbally uh, dismissive or 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 abusive and uh, abusive towards oh. a religion. Uh, mm. But I now, say alaikum when I got to the okay. But here, if I went outside and shout it, like, kind of, I'll just say, well, fuck God, you know, or Jesus, yeah, okay. Jesus is a wanker. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> then you know I can't go to prison for that. I can't uh, get into any kind of trouble. Of course, someone might, you know, slap me in the face and might get a bit angry, but I cannot be punishable uh, through a court or anything by, law, uh, yeah. by that. I, I, I guess, like, if I'm being hateful towards people and being, yeah. you know, like, really intimidating them, yes, I can go to court, um, like you know, phobia, for harassment. Like yeah, but, but in terms of what I say about a god, it's in this country, up it's up to me. Yeah. Um, yeah, shit. However, <laughs> yeah. However, in countries such as Indonesia, mm. uh, blasphemy is a law. Now, recently, about four years ago, um, there was a Christian, uh, a Christian. Oh God, forgetting a counselor, like a a mayor, maybe or something mm. like that, uh, from Jakarta. Wow. Um, I didn't hear. I didn't he, know that. he was Christian, but he's also Indonesian, um, and he was put to jail for two years um, because he was accused of being blasphemous. Um, I think he said something along the lines of Muslim people can't be uh, ruled by non-Muslim people. He was kind of making a joke about it or something like that, but he involved Islam in it. I don't know if he actually quoted a, a verse from, it, oh. from the Quran. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh my God, now you're Do going you... to politics now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember that? I remember that. That's yeah. about oh four years ago, God. I think, or maybe five years ago. Um, so anyway, I, I, I thought it, I thought it was interesting because because some countries obviously blasphemy is is still a really big thing, and I I, I haven't researched into it enough, but I think it can be punishable by death in some in very few countries still in the death penalty if if you're blasphemous i know indonesia is not like that and it's but there were people uh, anyway so i watched the video and and it, a lot of people were supporting this guy anok anok is it anok Aho. Aho. a lot of people were in support of him and saying that this is shouldn't be happening in this day and age other people were saying the government were too lenient and should have given him more prison time um so there's mixed feelings there's protests uh stuff like that and he was jailed for two years he's probably out now because that was like four years ago i don't know if he's back in politics probably not <laughs> after that but <clears throat> so i guess that's that's kind of like a case note anyway uh of of blasphemy in indonesia which i'm very interested about uh what i want to know is what are your views on on blasphemy should, you, should that still be punishable by even death in some in some cases or prison sentences well, there's still a lot of people in Indonesia uh, saying things like that, but just because they are not public figure, yeah, they're not famous. They get away with it. No mm -hmm. one cares. Yeah, does that yeah, make sense? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because you're talking about a mayor of Jakarta. Yeah, and then that's gonna be a big issue, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, because he's know. a famous, high-standing yeah. person. In terms of that, that means there is in the back about a politic. 100%. Oh, yeah. There is politics behind it. You so are... whoever wanted him removed from the office just used it as a weapon politics. against him, basically. Yeah. It can be. Yeah. People and what they what their agenda is. For example, I'm not too sure about the politics in Indonesia, but maybe the party who's against him, who's maybe in power, uh, say, oh, we'll, we'll, we'll put him in jail, kind of using religion as a weapon, kind of. Well, I'm not too sure what, what he really said on, on that video. It, because... 
this is evident from the media. I mean, media can get that the headline, not full story about it. They yeah, but they'll get the full story. If mm. you, s- I, I mean, if they show in the full story, maybe different. Sometimes when you talk, different situation, different mm. story, uh, different meaning. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. When I say fuck off to you now, and then people just say, oh, someone say fuck off to him. <laughs> you to put up with it. It's going to be yeah. bad, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. But if they can see the, the yeah. entire picture, and oh no, it's just a joke. Mm. Do you yeah. think blasphemy sh- should still have a place in law? No, yeah. I don't think so. Because f- for me personally, I always said one thing and I will always stand by it. So religion and uh, politics should be a two separate things. Always, at, at any circumstances, that's how I see it. And uh, combining the two is just asking for a disaster. Because you're always going to find something to blame someone for. And that's exactly how it's going to be. Or the idea or ideals the person have not gonna match with somebody else's then they're gonna start using religion against them or politics against them or whatever else mm. so it's always gonna be a mess i think religious things should be only for the spiritual things for people because this is exactly what religion is for mm. and to guide you Sorry. on the on the good good path and to help you to be a good person mm. and it have nothing to do with the political agenda I guess, but I guess you could say in religious terms, if you're being blasphemous, then I guess your God will judge you uh, about that in the end, anyway. Yeah, So exactly. why why should people get involved at, at this level? Go to jail, you know what I mean? Oh yes, if you're gonna be openly abusive and all that kind of stuff, I mean, that's a different story. If you're talking about other religions, it's, it's, kind, of, it's kind of a human right, more more of a thing. Like, so if I if I'm go next door and say you fucking Protestant bitch. <laughs> And you know, and and start antagonizing them. Then yes, you're being aggressive. You're being uh, yeah. what's the word? You're you're being harassing harassing them. You're bullying them. Yeah. But if you say something like a comment, maybe in the media or something. Yeah. About say I say in Indonesia, say I'm was big there as an actor, maybe. Yeah. And I said, um, oh, I don't I don't believe in God. Uh, and said something about Islam, maybe that it makes no sense to me or whatever, just for sake of argument. Do you think then that, that, that I should go to prison? No, no one go to a prison in Indonesia if you don't believe, if you say that, if you don't believe in Islam. The, 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 the problem is, are you going to be for fuck people? Mm. That is the problem. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah, so he's, he's obviously questioned a verse on the Quran about about something and he's, he's questioned it that, that maybe it's no longer uh, or maybe it's not very nice or something like that um, but he hasn't he hasn't said like you know all Muslims are because because his his gra- um, his uh, godparents I think were, were Muslim so that was his defense in court is like well if I'm being offensive to Muslims then I'm being offensive to my godparents and I'm, I'm not you know yeah, no, who's supporting him also is Muslim. It's in Jakarta, the mm. go- governor of Maya. However, however, I, I I have the, I mean, I've seen the way he talk as a leader in Indonesia, in Jakarta as well, on the media. It's not editing or whatsoever. He can with a little bit hard. Yeah. The word he used so, like you, like angry. You can't be a leader like that. What I'm saying is, uh, I'm not saying he didn't deserve that because I don't know him or anything like that. Mm. But I think getting to the right to the core of what we're talking about here, um, should there still be such a thing as blasphemy in terms of, like if, if we Google the word, the yeah, meaning, because it's a religious term. Mm. It's not like, law term, <clears throat> it's a religious term. In terms of offending the god or the religion, that's that's what it is, ultimately. Well, I agree. If he put something absolutely offensive towards the Muslim people, then of course he should he should be removed from office. But the action or offense of speaking sacrilegiously about God or sacred things, um, so yeah, it doesn't really. But I, th- I think it's no, it's it's going openly against religion, basically. Yeah, you know, questioning the the truth of it. That's that's what the thing is. Contempt or lack of reverence yeah. for God. Um, yeah. I don't, I don't, so, so if I kept saying to you like, "Oh, Muslim, Muslim, Muslim," every day, you're gonna kill me. 
I don't want to kill me, but you know what I mean? You're going to not like it very much. I don't need, you it, don't need to say that. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I mean? She already digs the grave in the garden, mate. <laughs> see the way you said to me, you dirty fucking Catholic or something like that. You know, I'm going to get fucking angry, even though I'm not even religious. Um, <laughs> so, so like, I, that way, right. Um, but, yeah, because because this is harassment. Yeah. And it's it's using the religion as... As a but I guess the target, it's yeah. the same kind of thing here. They're using the religion. Um, no, blasphemy is is religion. Is, is religious term. It only applies towards the religion, and it's 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 not aimed at people. But the thing is, if he said the Quran is whatever and uh, Allah doesn't exist and things like that publicly, that would be an open That's blasphemy. Yeah. But uh, if he referred to something that is from the sacred mm -hmm. book, right? And then twisted this, mm -hmm. that is a blasphemy as well. Mm -hmm. So so because he offended the Quran. Mm -hmm. So so if that is in that aspect, yes, he it's just he, a... he committed the blasphemy. But the question is that that should be involved in the court of law or not. Because yeah. this is a religious offence. Mm -hmm. It is not the law yeah. offence yeah. in the common law, isn't it? Yeah. So this is this is two different aspects of the whole situation I would say. Yeah. Uh, just one question: Why you should, why you do that? What? Why you, you why that people do that? I thought you were talking. Yeah, I was like, what? No, 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 what, I mean, what have uh, I done why, now? Why, why, why you do that? I mean, why you speak it up about? I think other maybe, people. I think are maybe. Leaving? I think maybe because he might have felt in the he might have been under a lot of pressure. No, no, I'm not just talking about him. About uh, yeah, anyone yeah. who's yeah. gonna do. Well, I I think if someone feels outnumbered. Um, you know, if I lived in, in uh, there was another woman, actually, and I, I cannot remember her name, who complained about the prayer noise being too loud. And she got sent to prison for blasphemy. That's um, bollocks, I'm sorry. Yeah. Because I'm not, the, sorry. I know which one you're talking no, about. No. If she is... Uh, no, that shouldn't be right. Oh, the Buddhist woman, yeah. She, she's a Buddhist woman. So... It, I guess if she had been Islamic, well, I suppose if she was Islamic, she would have complained. Not complained. <laughs> but uh, you, this is my point. I think when people are in a society that is dominated by Islam, then I think you're going to feel a little bit no, that's not true. Left out. Do you no, know what I mean? The, the, this, uh, I hate the media are pointing the thing like this, but the truth is, I don't think so. Okay, I don't think so. I, I, I don't know is that I, I, how for me to comment yeah. more detail to you guys because what I know is see all my video are against me media in Indonesia mm -hmm. they can like publish something doesn't make sense something like really uneducated something not important to publish they do that in Indonesia I'm sorry to say that's how the media do you know, rather than focus fucking educated people yeah. instead of them uneducated people. Okay. You know, about the ad hoc things, that is a political lot of thing. I like the way he he uh, he lead the the city, but in terms of his personality as a leader, I kind of a bit. Mm. Oh come on, you are a leader. You have to show. Yeah. It doesn't. Yes, you're a human being, but if you're a leader, you have to show to your your people that you 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 have to display your best well. side. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, display your best. We could talk about this uh, on and on. I, in the beginning, I was thinking we, we might not have a lot to say about this, but we, we clearly have. Um, That's why but, I don't talk about but, politics in Indonesia. <laughs> I don't like the politics but, either. But we're going to have to makes me angry. tie that up. Um, so that's blasphemy. That's less talk. We'll be back soon. Uh, get politics. into the comments. Yeah, no. let us know what you want us to discuss next. Uh, until then, see you later, guys. Yeah.